Wake up, Virtual Academy. This is Mr. Boyd with our morning announcements. Today's date is Thursday, March 31st, the last day of March. Let's start with our pledge. Place your hand on your heart and repeat after me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Hope you're having a great Thursday. Uh, wanted to start off with our riddle. We had um, some folks get it correct. So the riddle is, what is seen in the middle of March and April that can't be seen at the beginning or end of either month? The correct answer is the letter R. So great job with that. Okay, here's our new riddle for the day. You see a boat filled with people. It has not sunk, but when you look again, you don't see a single person on the boat. Why? So talk about it with your class and let us know. Okay, we have uh, getting to know, it's actually not gonna be Mr. Boyd this time. It is actually going to be a new person in our virtual academy. And so I will let them introduce themselves. Hey guys, it's Ms. Crowder, fourth grade teacher. Um, I just wanted to do two truths and a lie. And so I want to go on the same theme to see if anybody knows me. My fourth graders know me pretty well. I'm not sure they're going to remember some of these things. So I'm going to tell you two things that are true and one thing that's not true. So first is I managed the fourth largest bank in the nation. And the next one is I shaved off all of my hair one time. And the next one is I started college in 1990 and I graduated in 2009. So which one is a lie? I can't wait to see your responses. Make sure you email Mr. Boyd. Well, thank you, Ms. Crowder, for sharing a little bit about yourself. Students, think about the answers and share that with your teacher. Uh, so just some reminders for you. Um, Today is the last day for any new families to um, apply to the Virtual Academy. So if you're interested in having one of your friends join us, make sure you let them know to apply today. Um, also, high school students, I've reached out to each of your families. Ms. Edmondson and I have reached out to your families about SOL testing days. Um, so make sure that your parents are um, checking their email and checking their voicemails for any missed calls. Um, hope you have a great day today. Make it a great day. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.